Hey, what's up guys? It's Kyle here. Today I'm just making another creek video. Found this pretty neat scraper on the way. We have a possible point. Nope, oh, just a flake. It's a nice one. Seeing a little bit of work over here. What's this? Hmm. Oh. Man, told me. This is a pretty nice scraper. You see the work on top. I'll take stuff like this home. Possible preform. What is this? Another type of scraper, I guess. Move that one here. It's neat looking. All right, guys, I see something right there. Down there. Was that an old blade, you guys think? Or just natural? Well, it's cool looking, but I don't have room for it. What's this? There's just tools. All over the place. Oh wow. Check it out, we got a cell phone. <laughs> Get this out of here. Who's coming out of here? You definitely worked right there. But it's broken.
that is a dark ironated quartz. We'll take this home. This tributary has all new gravels. Here's a cool little worked piece. What else is here? Looks like a scraper. Yep. This is part of a tool. Wow, that's really pretty. Huh. Another scraper. Something really old. Art. Here we go, here's another scraper. Flake. I feel like we're gonna run into something good here soon. Just right there. Just right there. Nope. Does it work? Another scraper. 
but it got freeze pop broke this is interesting I think I just found a blade. Worked on one side. Look at this Sherbert scraper we have here. Orange and purple. Let's see what it looks like on the other side. Oh yeah. Wow. They were so creative with their tools. What is this? Nothing. Try something too heavy. I'm not taking it home. Head it back down. Something at one time. All right, I'm gonna call it possible point. Maybe. Oh, that is awful. I'd rather do a backflip on algae. This was something. Man. There's just flakes of stuff everywhere. This is pretty neat. It would be awesome to find a point in here. This kind of looks like a scraper. I think I just ran into a possible tool. It's a fresh break. Yeah, that was something at one time. Oh well.
Check this out, guys. There's definitely work all over it. The bottom's not. Looks like we knocked out a fossil. Yeah, what is this? I'm guessing an axe head, a blue axe head. Possible point. Preform. Right out of the mud. Perfect scraper. Thought I just found a point a point in the wall, but Shaped really odd. It is beveled on both sides. Looks like it's missing a base. Maybe. I think we got something here. Those might be natural breaks. Okay, let's find out. Yeah, I call it a scraper. Another one. I see something really orange down there. Interesting, some type of tool. I don't think I've ever been up this way. Let's just say something right here. might be something but I don't want it. I want this though. Look at that. This thing is so heavy though. Could you imagine this thing in a fish tank? There's no way I'm putting that on my shoulder.
check out these huge bedrock cracks. We're gonna dredge this up and see if there's any gold in it. I'm finding so much work stuff here. This is probably just a piece they use, but see on this side, on the top right here. Oh, wow. That's freaking pretty. I don't want to bring that home. I mean, that's huge. Oh, look at this. Perfect scraper. Wow. Have a possible point. Or oh, maybe they tried. Oh, that's all. I don't know. That's a tough one. Let's see what's hiding. Let's I just flipped this monster up from right here and it's right over the ledge. And you can see all that hematite in there. On this nice ads. Looks like it just rolled out of the dirt somewhere. Let's go hike up there a little bit. Kind of interesting. And. Oh, this was a stone they used. I could see hit nicks on it from uh, from making tools and stuff. It was pretty cool. Look at this. It's definitely a notch. Ah. Take a look at that. Holy smokes. That is a perfect ads. That looks like a nice arrowhead right there. But I'm sure it's fuller. Oh jeez. That's awesome. I've never been up here before. But I just found some rock shelters. Whoa, what's this? Oh, I thought it was a lock to something. You like a tool? Everything looks like a tool. I'm in like a 
freaky weird spot. Everything has worked. Look at this. Whoa. I'm gonna go ahead and climb up this hill and see what this little outcrop is about. This is really weird. Huh. Rocks placed around the tree nicely. Interesting. Pretty cool. Is that all right guys i think i just walked up on the find of my lifetime i hope this isn't a fuller or i'm just gonna delete this whole video all right let's slowly go in oh my gosh do you guys see that I'm dunking her. Possible blade. It's like a chip blade. What are these things? I'm sure one of you guys will know. Just a chip. Just came across another tool. And I believe I see another one. Oh, is that Patrick? Nope. Eh. Possible blade. I would say most definitely. Just found a piece of a point. Here's one of them quartz balls kind of flat so and it feels solid
I'm still in shock from what I just found. I was going to do a gold video today, but it ended up as an artifact video. And it is going to be awesome. I think I just spotted out another ads. Sure is. A little bit older, but it's in rough shape. I'll let someone else have it. Here's another scraper. worked Pretty cool colors right here. This might be an ads. Old beat up one. Out of so many. In really can really nice condition. Here's something. Makes sense. Put the thumb right there and start scraping. It's pretty neat. I'm going to keep this one. Got a piece of something right here. Nice scraper. I believe this is a fire treated scraper. You can see all the work on the edge. Oh, he was left handed. Check that out. There's the thumbprint. Interesting. That's pretty too. I see something else with a white patina. And it's just an old rock. All right. 
what are these? Well, that's natural. Thought it was gonna be thinner. Chipping it off to make stuff with this. This was this was a material they were using. They would use the unique designs. It's neat. It's that little guy right here. Some art. Here's a tool. something Another piece of a point should look like it for a second didn't it I'll be coming back next week and we're gonna dredge all this up. Just came over here. There's a piece of lead right there. I think we have another possible point. It's in the water right there. The drill. Cool. That's a tool. There's no scraper, kind of rough. I just found another very nice scraper.
Another scraper. Look at this piece they were working off of. Look at that blue and purple in there. Orange, yellow. Amazing. And is uh is this one of those fire starting rocks? What do you guys think? Well guys, I hope you enjoyed that hunt. I'm on my way back to the truck now, so the next time you will see me is when I'm back at the house looking at all these finds. Or if I find something on the way to the truck, which is very possible. All right, that's definitely another tool of some sort. I don't know what they would use it for. Smoothing stuff out, I guess. Oh yeah. Oh my gosh, guys. This is like my best find in my entire life. And I don't even know what it is. I'm not sure if it's supposed to be like that or if it had a base. This looked like a King Corner Notch at one time. You see the work up here. Uh, no idea what this is. Broken base, I believe. What do you guys think? Closer look at it so you guys can see the craftsmanship. Check this out. Definitely a uh, whole piece. But yeah, if you guys know anything about anything, please let me know. Definitely, if you guys know what this is, I'm guessing a spear point. I don't know. Um, I think those Indians would start their fires by putting a little tinder in there and rubbing a stick back and forth very fast. And that's how they would start their fires. Something else very interesting. Remember this red rock I picked up? This arrowhead came from this rock. How cool is that? Crazy. Uh, one piece of early 1900s glass. I think this is an old, old blade of some sort. Like archaic, probably. I got a little bit of work pieces here. Uh, this is quite odd. I was worked on this side and nothing here, so just smooth something like that. Uh, here's another just worked piece. Uh, I believe this is most likely a drill. Old one. We got here, this is uh, they're trying to make something here. It almost looks like this blade that they made out of a chip. Check this out. Look at that one, one nick they gave that just to hold it, just like that, or just like this actually. Here's another scraper. Move down a little bit. What I have noticed is they're very, very creative with their colors. This is like a sher sherbet, a sherbet, whatever you want to call it. Um, and then you got like your your purple and blue, your reds, your speckled reds. I mean, it is crazy. Check this one out. This, they worked it on the side. And then they rubbed something in here to get a, a groove or a dent in it 
so their finger could fit in there. Just like so. I believe I have some woodworking tools as well. Uh, this guy. This guy's has worked all over the place if I put it up to the light. But anyways, you hold him. Yeah, just like so. Maybe I was using my other hand. But anyways, you can see right there. They would just scrape wood away or do whatever. Here's a little, little scraper. This is the old one. Uh, here we have an ads. Use this a hoe, a scraper, a knife. I got this thing right here. This was definitely worked. There's worked marks on it. I think this was going to be one of those cool blue axe heads until they took a notch out right here and didn't realize there was a fossil in it and then they just threw it back. So I'll call that a preform. We have this big thing. I found a piece of petrified wood that looked exactly like this. Here's a very nice scraper. And then yeah, we got your purple scrapers. And then there's always like a little thumb mark too. So you could tell if they're left-handed or right-handed. And some are ambidextrous, obviously. Yeah, this has worked very nice. This is a really weird piece I found. It looks like a face. I found this by an overhang. Kind of weird. Uh, what else do we got here? Oh, we have this huge scraper for some big ass Indian. That is so scary. Well, I guess it's not that big, but you could do some work with this thing. And this right here, I don't know what the heck they were making, but it is pretty neat. It's super worked. Maybe they were going to tie it up somehow and use that as an axe. Got a very big piece of hematite. Listen how heavy this thing is. Jesus. But yeah, guys, that's... uh. Pretty much it. I mean, I think I had a very good day. Oh my gosh, I cannot stop looking at this thing. And this uh, is five inches exactly. I measured it. Five inches exactly. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. It was super fun. Making the video was not fun on my back because that backpack was about 350,000 pounds. But we found this guy today and it is just beautiful. I cannot believe it. Man. But anyways, if you guys are not subscribed to my channel, please do so. I could use all the support I can. And a lot of videos are coming out. And it's going to get crazy this summer, as I said last video. So, as always, I will see you on the next adventure.